CETA FASTER 24-2C is a recently added strategy in 2019. Macular damage may occur in early glaucoma, even in glaucoma suspects. Early glaucoma damage may appear in the OCT in the inferior macular region and in the corresponding visual field at the superior central part. The classic 24-2 test locations are 6 degrees apart, so there are 12 locations in the central 10 degrees. On the other hand, the 10-2 strategy test locations are 2 degrees apart and there is 68 points tested. Therefore, glaucoma damage can easily be missed with the 24-2 test. The central 10 degrees, in case of 24-2, are tested by, with 12 points and in case of 10-2 are tested by 68 points. Glaucoma damage may appear at locations not detectable by the 24-2. In the new 24-2C, the classic 6 degrees apart locations and the central 10 degrees are replaced by new locations vulnerable to glaucoma damage, shown here in orange color. Here two examples of a printout of the new strategy. The second character of this new strategy is being fast. It is shorter by 30% than the CETA fast and by 53% than the CETA standard. Shorter test duration is achieved through several mechanisms. First, the primary test locations in CETA FAST starts by 25 decibel stimulus and then step down till threshold is reached. The two staircase test sequence are performed at each of the primary points. In case of CETA FASTER test sequence being at the edge corrected normal threshold and only one staircase reversal is required. Second, as you know, CETA strategy depends on visual field models of the normal and the glaucomatous patients. In case of CETA FAST, the models were dependent on the full threshold program, which was available at that time. As the, the CETA FASTER is recently added, the new models are used are those of the CETA FAST normal values being available, thus more time efficient testing could be achieved. Again, fixation loss and false negative tests were omitted in case of CETA FASTER. Locations with zero decibel are tested once only in case of CETA FASTER in contrast to CETA FAST. The 300 millisecond delay after non-seeing stimuli at the end of the response time window before a new stimulus is presented is omitted in case of CETA FASTER.
One has to keep in mind that results between the two algorithms are not directly interchangeable. Studies show that a good correlation between the two algorithms regarding the mean deviation and the visual field index. This is in case of mild, moderate, severe glaucoma and in the normal. But results are not interchangeable. As you can see here, the mean deviation may vary between plus 2.9 to minus 3.4 and the visual field index may vary between plus 9% to minus 10% between the two algorithms. The take home message is that CETA faster strategy test the central points vulnerable to glaucoma damage that may be missed with previous strategies Again, this new strategy is of short duration, but results cannot be exchanged with the previous strategies. Thank you for your attention.